Long time ago, in a kingdom named Cape Town, lived the Emperor Florence. He loved flowers. So the whole town was full of flowers and beautiful trees. The air smelled like perfume. One day, while watering flowers in his garden, the emperor realized that he was growing old and he must choose a successor for his throne. Who would the successor be? Since he loved flowers so much, he decided to let the flowers choose. The next day, a proclamation was issued. All the children will collect a seed from the emperor and plant it. Whoever can show me their best in a year's time will succeed me to the throne, he said. Ping, a little boy who loved gardening, was the happiest that day. All the children were excited and they started nourishing their seeds. So did Pink. He carefully put his seed in a pot of rich soil and nurtured it. Days passed, but nothing grew in his pot. He transferred the seed to a bigger pot with new soil. He waited for two months, but still nothing grew in his pot. He got disheartened but did not stop trying. He had faith in Almighty God and himself. Whole year passed. All the children had their pots filled with beautiful flowers. But Ping's pot was empty. Feeling sad, he decided to go to his father. I tried everything, father, but it did not sprout. He cried. Have faith, my child. You did your best and your best is good enough to present to the emperor. His father assured. At the palace, the emperor was smiling looking at so many beautiful flowers. Right then, Ping and his empty pot caught his eye. Looking at the empty pot, he called Ping and asked, Why is your pot empty? I gave my best, but the seed did not sprout, he said crying. Emperor's face glowed with a bright smile and he announced, I have found one child who is worthy of being the emperor. I have no idea. Where did you all get your seeds? As the seeds I gave you were all cooked, it was impossible for any of them to sprout. With his hard work, honesty and faith, Ping became one of the most promising emperor. Thank you for being such great listeners. I hope you all enjoyed the story.